Hey everyone, I'm meteorologist Eric Fisher taking a look at a couple of rain chances ahead. The first will be tonight for parts of the area watching this little batch of rain that's sliding down out of Canada. Most of this will be across Vermont, New Hampshire and far northern Massachusetts as we head into the evening and overnight and generally we're talking about very light amounts. Now temperatures will hold up into the 50s all night tonight. Again, that best rain chance is mainly north of the Mass Pike. Now, tomorrow is an interesting day. Some warmer, muggier air will move in. Most of the region will jump up into the 70s, few towns even hitting 80 degrees. The one spot that we'll be watching for potentially some cooler air to hold on for a good part of the day would be from Cape Ann across the Newburyport area and up toward the seacoast. I think this may be a cooler pocket where it fights the warmer trend for the rest of the region. So it's no surprise to folks who live there. It is, of course, the coolest part of our area this time of the year, but that would be a holdout, if you will. Rockport going for a high of 68. Meanwhile, Boston at 76, 80 in Taunton, 77 in Worcester, and near 70 on the Cape. And we'll also be tracking some rain. So overnight, again, again the best chances to the north. Tomorrow morning, I think there could be some showers mainly again northern Massachusetts and into New Hampshire. Otherwise, partly sunny skies and a few more pop-up showers will be possible in the afternoon. Again, mainly to the north. Then tomorrow night, this is the bigger rain chance for all of us. And it's in the middle of the night, some heavier downpours, some thunder, lightning, locally torrential downpours are possible here. And that will linger into early on Thursday morning. This will be our most significant rain chance over the next six to seven days or so. That rain will taper off on Thursday morning, but can't rule out a pop-up shower on Thursday afternoon. Rain amounts, you know, it's going to vary a lot with this plume of heavier rainfall exactly where those thunderstorms track, but I certainly think there's a chance for parts of our area to see over an inch of rainfall in those downpours, maybe even some isolated two-inch rainfall totals. So where it rains, it'll pour. Also muggier for Wednesday and Thursday, especially Wednesday afternoon into Thursday afternoon. That will be peak humidity before we drive back out heading into the end of the week, and it really looks nice. A Friday, mix of sun and clouds, mid to upper 70s, upper 70s to near 80 on Saturday. Looks like a great start to the weekend. Lower 80s on Sunday inland, some sea breezes in the afternoon kicking in at the coast, and 70s on Monday, that next rain chance arriving by Tuesday. But the majority of our rain coming Wednesday night.